What's going on, guys? I'm back with another video, and this will be my first one from... Oh, let me go fix this right now. All right. Perfect. All right. This is my first video from, from Suzy. He's a good entertainer. He has the realest damn stories, and I love it. One of the few YouTubers I could say that his stories are so fucking real that I enjoy it. So, you know... Right now, we're going to look at Instagram thoughts or thoughts. Because the way he put it, you messy, man. You're a messy-ass dude. Talk about Instagram thoughts. Just like when somebody called, somebody said the infamous word, Twitch thoughts. So we're going to get to this video. If you like this video, comment, subscribe for more. I will put more videos out later this weekend. This will be my last video for the day because I got to get some sleep. Because I just came from work, so I'm trying to get some much bills as much as I can. Let's get into it. Can somebody tell me what's up with everybody painting their teeth and the whites of their eyes extra white on Instagram? Was there a meeting and I just missed it? You ever seen somebody who overdoes it? Nobody's eyes glow like that, bro. You got her looking like Lord Raiden from Mortal Kombat. Why come people out here trying to get all philosophical on the gram? Writing the entire Old Testament in their caption. Here's a spoiler alert. Don't nobody read past the second line. Also, why come everybody out here just putting random job titles in their bio? <laughs> Actor. Model. I'm just super saying. No tea, no sh**. Hey, shouldn't it technically say aspiring actor or aspiring model? Mm, no tea, no shade. That kind of sounds way too familiar. I mean, one of his videos, one of, one of the ladies that he was trying to hook up with left him stringing, so, I mean, left them stranded, so, you know, that's why I heard, like, all, no tea, no shade. I said, yeah, mm -hmm. trying to be shady, dude. Let's go, let's go. I know a lot of people look at their Instagram as their resumes, but could you imagine if I did that in real life on a physical resume? Guy would be sitting there in an interview. Okay, it says here you're an NBA player, a British fashion designer, <laughs> race car driver, a swimsuit model, and a Cirque du Soleil performer. <laughs> okay, it also says here you're a rapper. <laughs> Yo, you ever dropped that album, though? <laughs> nah. Okay, okay, well, if I gave you a beat, could you bust a freestyle or something? Drop it. Yo, I think I'm Big Meech, Larry Hoover, with the work. Oh, hallelujah. Okay, that, that, <laughs> I think that's Rick Ross. You're, yes, that, yeah, that's yeah. a Rick Ross song. No, 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 that's all me. I, I just, that was off the dome. Or right, whatever, give me, give me, give me another one. No, 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 stop it. Stop it with the trolling, dude. No more. Oh, God. One nation under God. Yeah. All right, let's go. She's in love with who I am. Back in high school, I used to bust it to the dance. 21, 21, 21, 21, 21. Uh, pretty sure that was Drake and somehow mixed a 21 Savage. But yeah, that's how it looks like when people just put random titles in their bio. But I get it. Instagram is hard. It's hard out here. Even the simplest thing, your profile picture. Can't just take a selfie and post it anymore. You gotta have lights. The sun has to be in the right position. You gotta hire a makeup artist. You gotta hire a photographer. It's gotta be the best picture you've taken in the last like 57 months but even with that some of y'all out here overdoing it this one time this girl dm me we decide to go out on a date i'm walking into the restaurant this person holds the door open for me and i walk past them and i'm like thanks keep on walking the girl that held the door was like <laughs> you're funny okay so i walk over to the hostess and the girl that held the door walks up next to me what's good to eat here i've never been here i'm thinking to myself why is this person still talking to me Wait, you're the girl? <laughs> Looked nothing like she did on Instagram. And you know what else kind of annoys me? Is when one of my lady friends tells me... <laughs> yes, the expectation. And then... <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Expectation for 
versus reality. That's true. That's absolutely true. Yes, I do agree with that. Expectation versus. Yo. Oh my God. Why? What has it? Come? What has this work? Let's go. Let's go, guys. Let's go. My boyfriend's really jealous, and he's making me unfollow you. Okay, congratulations on your trusting relationship, because it seems very secure. I'm just super saiyan, no tea, no shade, none of my business, nor my concern. You can always tell when a girl becomes single on Instagram. They take that I'm happy for no reason picture. They're usually in midair. Nobody's that happy on a Tuesday and on some Zelda side mission stuff. Couples do this too. Whenever I see couples posting pictures, we're so happy, we're so in love. In reality, it's the opposite. You can't trust everything you see on the gram. I was dating this girl and she was obsessed with this Instagram Tumblr model. Dude had a super sharp jawline and these piercing green eyes. I'd see her liking his pictures and I'm over here like, mm -hmm. and all that. Then one day my friend Priscilla comes to my house and she brings two of her friends. First friend walks in, hey, nice to meet you. Second friend walks in, and it's the model dude. Shake his hand and I instantly realize this dude's eyes are black, like blacker than mine. He photoshops every single picture. Those were not contacts on his Instagram. My life is a lie. But y'all don't want me to take Instagram seriously because it's gonna be a problem. Wow, I cannot. People be, photo Yo, people be photoshopping, man. People gotta be careful, yes, be careful who you talk to on the internet, you never know. You never know who you might be end up with. Be careful on the internet, guys. That's all I gotta say. You know what I'm saying? Not everyone is meant to be, not everyone is real. I had a video saying, you know, you gotta be careful because some of these people are fake, some people are fugazi, some people are just, you know, bullshitters. That's all I gotta say, bullshitting. So you gotta be careful. You gotta be careful who you mess with. And be careful who you talk to, okay? Be careful who you talk to. Let's go. Um, for all y'all, I love the app. I'll hop on, check all my friends' stories, check my DMs, scroll, 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 close the mm. app, and then open it right back up because I feel like I'm missing something. But mark my words, I'm going to start taking Instagram seriously. And once I lose like 15 pounds, I'm going to get a BBL, and then I'm going to get my six-pack right. And once them jeans that I ordered from Fashion Nova come in the mail, <laughs> I'm going to stunt so hard and cancel Christmas on all y'all. Listen, guys. This is an awesome video. If y'all want me to do more videos about my boy Susie, let me know. Because this is my first one, and I like it so far. If you want me to do more of the videos, if you want me to do his past videos, please let me know in the comments and subscribe to his channel. I put the original video in the description, okay, guys? If you like this video, comment, subscribe for more. Please, let's get up to 1,000 subs this year. I want to get up to 1,000 subs this year. If, we, if I do, I will probably, listen, if I get up to 1,000 subs before December, I will do a eight-hour I would do a eight hour broadcast, okay? I would do a eight hour broadcast. Anybody could join, just let me know. If I get up to a thousand subscribers before December, before December, not after, before December, I will do an eight hour, actually, I would do an eight hour podcast, okay? I would do an eight hour podcast. Anybody could join, just let me know, okay, guys? That's it for the video. I am done for the day. I'll probably be doing more this weekend. All right, guys. It's your boy, M.E. I'm about to get some damn seat because I'm fucking tired. And I got to watch the race because I missed it. All right, guys. Peace.